Hi everyone! Welcome back to episode 5 of Love Sweets, where Itsuki is about to go purchase lunch because he forgot um, his lunch at home. So in episode 4, to keep it short, Itsuki is hired at Cafe Chocolat, but Master Tokita wants Itsuki to find another female waitress, and Itsuki chooses Yui, who declines at first, but accepts because Itsuki uses enjoying tea as a bargaining chip. The fact that they can enjoy tea while working. So let's see what happens next. What I do like today, I'll go without it, but I'm reluctant because my student, um, or it's flooded with a student variety and a favorite one can be bought that isn't liked. So I wonder if he's talking about um, what's available for purchase for students. Uh, maybe there's a lot of good choices. Moreover, there's a trend like Snorty, um, so, oh, so I think, um, it's like 30 year students, um, they get priority, so they're always the first to go purchase, and, um, then it gets, then it goes to the rest of the students. So sometimes all the good stuff, um, they get bought up by the 30 year students, and, um, all that's left is, um, that's the rest of the stuff. But at least um, the pricing is right. It's cheap and it's affordable for students. Okay, so um, hmm, what should I eat for lunch then? So I think he's finally um at the lunch line and you can see all the stuff that's um for sale. It went well, and I think I should, um, hand out the... So I think he wants the cutlet sandwich. Because it's a lunch break, um, it may have been sold out. If that happens, I will have to reconsider it again. But it'll be impossible for lunch. Okay, so what's going on? Oh, um, I'm sorry. Hmm? So he turns around and um, he tries to see where the voice is coming from. Oh, so it's a small figure that pushes everyone aside. So I wonder if she's cutting in line or something. Okay, so what's wrong with this? Say no, don't kick whether you say that you're pushed aside about. Um, so I wonder why she's so impatient and why she would want to cut in line. Oh, I'm sorry, um, please make room. There's a danger of bringing to the bones if you crash into a guy um, who will splash um, a big boy school student. Not sure what that means. But I think it's like, um, oh, well, gentlemen has to let ladies aside. Or um, give ladies the way. And that child kind of feels like a wild boar. 
and just dashes straight. We'll assume that this um, will make the room splendidly. Oh, thank you very much! Okay, so she's coming through. Well, when a good thing is done, um, you kind of, um... Let's see, I'm not sure how to say this. So, um, when you do good deeds, uh, you kind of reward yourself. It feels like this, so I... Um, let's see. So I guess you can eat all that on Cutlet Sandwich after 500 yen. I think. Hi everyone. So unfortunately, I had to cut out a few parts. Because, um, when this girl tried to cut in line and fell over, she exposed her underwear, and there was a little bit of a discussion about that. But then after that, the main character tried to get her up, and then she was talking about how, um, the floor is more slippery than before. Um, it got waxed, it's clean. And when she tries to get up, um, she can feel the pain that she endured when she hit the floor. It looks like the main character, Itsuki, helped her up. And I still don't get it why um, she has to cut in line, because it's kind of unfair for people that are patiently waiting for the turn at the lunch line. And yeah, three years get priority. But um, this girl... We'll become a three-year someday, so there's no need to worry about that either. But let's see what she has to say. Okay, so are you okay? I'm all right. Oh, so that's a that's a pretty quick recovery. Oh yeah, welcome. Okay. It's good. I'm glad. Oh, um, of all the places where you're embarrassed. Uh, you can say that. Or not really. What's this trouble, um, for whether the claws were, um, something which shouldn't have been seen? Oh, please excuse me then. Okay. So after stretching the spine, um, so just after stretching, um, the girl just ran away. Yeah, so there's, there's some crazy people as well. So, um, as expected, the purchase was crowded, but somehow I was able to buy what I wanted. Oh, so, um, at least, um, he was able to get the item that he wanted. Let's see, um... So I wonder what kind of thing it is, um... The rice will be delicious. Okay, so now he's gonna, um... Have his lunch in the courtyard. Where he can enjoy this, um, really nice garden in the middle. Trees... Um, a, all these, um, lawn... And the nice sun and the atmosphere. Yeah, so it's also sunny and there's a lot of people out here. Oh, this is pretty nice. So this is what he bought from the um the lunch line. Okay, so he's gonna start eating.
Hmm, I wonder if this is the same person that tried to cut in line. Oh, so excuse me, um... Are you free? Um... So yeah, so he's staying alone. It's just kind of natural because, um... He doesn't have any more friends. But, um... I think the other places are... Filled. Because it's not the place for, um... Okay, so, um... Oh, so this place is open. There's... It's, he's not reserved for anyone. So, okay. Alright, so he tells her, okay. It's open. Oh, I'm sorry about that, um, but thank you very much. Okay, so it's the same person that tried to cut in line. And then, um... Okay, oh, well, you can stay until the end. So the eyes met. Okay. Okay, so it was that same person as before. So that's where he mentions it. Okay, so now she's seated. Um, let's see. A girl didn't avert her eyes from me and sat in the bench. Oh yeah, it's very crowded, so I purchased it. I was surprised. So I wonder if um she's not very comfortable with crowds, and that's why she wants to. Just hurry up and get it done, and not have to worry about being in a crowd or um, being in front of a lot of people. Oh, it is so. It looks like um the style beauty. Um, let's see. Is in fact it's the first time I'm coming here, it's not it. Um after all, um there's only seniors, so it's hard to get in. Um let's see. In fact it's the first time um I'm coming here, isn't it? After all. Um, there's only senpais that's hard to get in. Okay, so she's an underclassman. She's about the height of Iori. Maybe a little shorter. So I'm kind of going back to the same thing, so like... There's no purpose of her having to cut in line. But probably she wanted the item so badly. Because eventually she'll be a senior as well. And she'll be able to have priority when um, she buys stuff from the lunch line. Let's see, it says, um, it seems to be opposite tension to, um, Hatsu. And I do not scare if I first meet. So I'm not really familiar yet either. <laughs> oh, so you must be a senpai, right? Well, in a sense it is. Uh, because I, um, it doesn't come too much. I answer while pushing the straw into, um, the milk carton. Okay, so she is, um, a junior. But she's kind of, um, energetic, in a sense. Uh, senpai, senpai. Oh, okay. Um, what a junior. Uh, 
Okay, so, um, for letting me, um, have a seat over here, I'll give you, um, a ham egg sand sandwich in exchange. So I wonder if the, if the ham egg sandwich was what she wanted in the lunch line, and it's a very popular item that gets sold out very, very quickly. But then, um, school should, um, do some kind of survey, and they kind of have an estimate of which, um, item is the most popular to be, um, sold, and they can make more of it. And given that the school's pretty smart in academics, they should be able to think of this idea. Okay, so, um, this girl gives our main character a ham egg sandwich. In addition to um, his cutlet sandwich that he bought from the lunch line. Hmm, so I wonder what this child is. Um, so there's a fearless image, or fearful image. And there's a superior talking about it, but there's also no feeling that I am freaked out and... So what do you want now? Uh, um, so, um... For me and buy this, um, I like to buy this cutlet sandwich which is cold and isn't so good actually. So I wonder if, um, he kind of realizes that what he bought isn't as great as, um, that ham egg sandwich that, um, this underclassman or this junior bought. Oh, I'm sorry, um, I was kind of being rude. Okay, so what's going on now? It looks like, um, she's looking kind of depressed. So, um, yeah, so what's going on in your mind? Like, um, Oh, um, it's nothing really much. Okay. Um, when she isn't talking, surely, um, this, um, person is like a, um, typewriter that never, um, stops. So I think he's talking about how she too talks a lot, and, um, So it, um, it's also superior to associate with that, and as far as they seem to be appealing, um, for the size of my um bowl, or um, my portion, and I'm sorry about that. Not sure what that means. Oh, um, on the sleeve of a blazer, um, the milk. Okay, so what, so what does the milk have to do with this? Maybe she spilled it? Oh wow, catastrophe beyond imagination. Oh, so I think she wants the milk. If you say earlier, such thing is saved for such thing. And whether it will be tasty later. Okay, so I think, um, they spill some milk, and it looks like, um, this girl wants to, um, lick the milk from the spill, which is kind of, uh. Okay, I'm not really sure what this girl's up to, but she's kind of getting crazy. Oh, it's supposed to be amazing. Um, only a fellow strange of all things. Um, and a strange smell only on one side. Oh, such good news for, um, senpai. Oh, uh, what, um, your parents' home dry cleaner? Um, I'll ask this, um, 
by tomorrow morning. Okay, when I gave a loud voice, it crushed the knees on the knee, so I should get the right side down. Uh. That was so fun until just now, um, is it reversed and isn't rock bottom? Because I'm simply bad, I cannot scatter anything. Oh, Senpai's really funny, isn't he? So I really don't know what's going on between um, our main character Itsuki and this um, little girl. And it's like, Relu reluctantly, Junior, I'm defeated by you. Yeah, so enough of that um, really um, confusing, compre confusing um, conversation. But um, so I think he probably spilled milk. And it's like, oh, that's okay. I'm just going to suck it up. I'm going to drink it from the spill, which is kind of weird. And um, I think um, it looks like um, he's going to go back to class. Oh, okay, so now it's after school and it's time for him to go to his part-time job. It's actually his first actual day. Isn't it going to work at least? Uh, at last? So he's going to get the experience that he missed out on that his other friends have gotten. Um, so I was thinking that I'll spend nothing at the end of the spring vacation and then just arrived kind of blank at this um, year. And it's like, oh, so he's talking about what he usually did, and so I always made rice in the morning, and then went to school, and then occasionally played and go home, and then started making rice again. So if I did not report, perhaps I wonder what school life um, that has not changed anymore was continuing. So probably because of, he's a wonder, like, so if I did follow my friends and did the part-time job, um, I wonder if anything would change. Or maybe I would have been able to stick together with my friends a little bit more. Well, um, I also want to go out with someone and would like to make um, various things or do a lot of things together. Such thoughts have come into my eyes since, um, let's see, what was it? Um, since, um, I'm not really sure what that says. Let's just continue. Because it isn't the reason I didn't have so far. It may be right to become strong. Nevertheless, I have to work hard. Because if I'm idle, um, a reputation isn't made. And I'll do my best with my full power towards it. And I'll keep doing this until I graduate. Okay, so he was talking about how like um he kind of goes back to his memories about um how he missed out about the part-time job versus his friends. And he kind of wonders like, well... Um, I wonder if it, life would, would have been different, and, but either way, I have to look forward now because um, I'm going to be, um, like what they're doing now is something that, something that I will eventually do, so I must step for work hard and I must um, understand 
what real life is like. And the part-time job is just the beginning of what real life is like. And he's still thinking about getting that girlfriend that his um, friends have already done. And as he was thinking about all that stuff, um, he notices... Um, so a classroom comes t into him and he kind of notices something interesting going on. So he hears some, some voice in a classroom that's seemingly empty. And he kind of becomes curious and wonders what's going on. Oh, okay, so um, I'm pretty sure um, we've seen her before in episode one. So this is the girl that um, the friends were talking about. Oh, um, if you really want a girlfriend, you can try to go out with her, because I'm pretty sure nobody has ever asked her out because of she's so far above us. So she's actually reading magazines and she's humming some tune. <laughs> oh, um, we should try making this today. And he recognizes who she is. Wait, um, her? So this must be, um,. Let's see, Otonashi Kanai. So now he remembers um what his, fr his friends told him about her. Oh yeah, the, the person with um the highest grades, popular among boys. And some boys were even jealous, or some of Itsuki's friends were even jealous. Um, they wished that their girlfriend was as good as um her. And it's like, well, um, she's so far above us that um, there's no way we're fit for um, her. We cannot hold a candle to her. Um, because I'm a person without a border, I suitably talk with each other. But she's kind of beautiful in a certain way. I wonder what she's doing. Or what she's thinking about. Hmm. So, um, beyond knowing her name, I don't really know m much else about her. Um. Let's see. I, I myself are not a prominent type of this person. Well, I don't speak until graduation. Um, so as to speak, um, like um, the Taka Mines flower. So it's like, oh, this is something too lofty to consider. Um, there's no way I'm like um a perfect match for her. Oh, um, this is not the case when. Well, this isn't when this is being done. Um, I have no time when a girl is being seen emptily. Okay, so she looks up and she notices Itsuki's observing her. Um, before I knew it, um, can I? Otonashi um, suddenly turned around and looked up. And by some reason, the eyes matched perfectly. <laughs> um, well then, isn't it? Um, goodbye. I became uncomfortable recently 
made the place later so that I might lower my head and run away. Oh, so, um... So, when she looked up at him, she kind of, he kind of feel frightened, like, oh, no. She noticed me. And he was afraid of, um, that something bad's gonna happen. And he runs off. Let's see. Not surprisingly, it is surprising if anyone can see it as such a close friend. So I think it's um the feeling that um well I'm she's too good for me and when he he looked at her he kind of feel like oh no he's like this is kind of um this is really it's really nervous I I'm being really nervous about it um tension's really high I can't handle it anymore um like someone as low class as me looking up to a high class like her um it's just so awkward but anyways um. He's now at his part-time job, and it took about 20 minutes to go from the school to this part-time job at Cafe Ho Chocolat. Uh, meanwhile, the face of that soundlessness floats and disappears. Um, the feeling of um that image of um Kanai Otonashi just disappears. So I think he got some relief by coming to here and it's like, well, just forget about that. Or forget about her. But she's such a beautiful child, so it cannot be impossible to be conscious. Uh, oh, it's the kun So here's Enjo san. So her, her first name is Minamo. So it's like, oh, hello, I am Minamo Enjo. Very nice to meet you. And with that in mind, I'm gonna actually stop the video here because um, I, f I have a feeling that the next part's gonna be quite long. Um, because we're gonna see how Itsuki, or like um, how's Itsuki's first day at work, or at his part-time job. And I kind of apologize about this episode because it was kind of confusing. I didn't really know what was going on myself. First with that um crazy girl that cut in line. And they had all this discussion about um juniors, seniors, etc. But then we also see that um as he was leaving school, he noticed um like this idol girl, um, Kanai. Sitting in the room by herself, just looking at um, magazines and humming some tunes. And when she noticed him, that was kind of the scary um, reaction, and he just ran off. I wonder if um if he's going to be able to talk to her eye for eye at some point in the future. And with that in mind, I'll see you later.